So just about every other weekend, I make banana pancakes from scratch because every time I buy bananas, I buy them in a big bulk and I normally can't eat them all right away because I do use them in smoothies. I bake with them sometimes. So normally when I get to this stage where the banana is starting to get like super brown, I go ahead and make myself some banana pancakes. So that is what I'm going to do since I started learning how to make things from scratch, I feel so much more accomplished, if that makes sense. Like, instead of just going to the supermarket and buying it in a pre-made pancake mix and just mixing in an egg and oil or whatever the directions are, I feel so much more accomplished when I make it from scratch, especially if it tastes good. I've been trying to journal as much as I can remember every single day, even if it's just a small paragraph. I have been trying to keep up with it, and so far I've done pretty good. I've only missed a couple days here or there, but I want something that I can look back on in a couple years because I know I will most definitely not remember everything that ever happened this year. So writing in a journal can help me look back on the little small victories that come along in 2024. Which is another reason I started my YouTube channel, besides tracking my language learning process, which I have most definitely deviated from on this channel. Plus, journaling is a nice way to deal with the many emotions that I feel often, and I wish I'd started journaling a lot sooner. Today, it unexpectedly but expectedly snowed. I really wasn't expecting it to snow today. I know all weekend it's supposed to, but I didn't know today was included in that. So what better to do than get cozy and read a book? And I am already halfway into Akatar, and I feel like I'm kind of getting bored, <laughs> but that could just be my short attention span. But obviously I'm going to keep going. I'm getting a little bit bored with it and I don't know if it's because I've just become increasingly busy since I started reading this. But what better than to do right now than to read since I have the free time. I'm currently on chapter 25. I didn't see any spoilers really on TikTok but I kind of heard people's reactions or reviews to the second book and maybe that's what's keeping me from continuing to read. Not that my opinion is about to be based on theirs, but, and I feel like I don't want to be betrayed, which is probably what is taking me so long to pick it back up. Something good might not happen and I don't want to read that. I don't know, I'll continue. If my heart is broken, 
I will let everyone know. <laughs> and I will blame everyone on TikTok for my despair.